Case study number five uh, deals with the Rokin area and it's called Beyond Consumerism Intervening Rokin. And in this case, it's all about trying to go beyond the actual consumer that buys stuff and leaves the space. We know that it's going to be crowded. It's now a building site. It's a lot of construction that is going on. But in a few years, there will be um, only from the metro 50,000 people per day. And so there's quite a lot of concern that these sorts of redevelopments will affect the identity of uh, this area, of the street, which, which is an, historically an important street, uh, which used to be a canal, which has now been covered over. What our case study is about is to think if there's anything which we could propose to, to, to add to the street, to, to make it better, to uh, make it more in favour of, um, of maybe the local residents or of people who might not be able to consume um, to the extent of those who go to the luxury shops. So as a working method, there is a few things that we used. We used uh, interview techniques to talk to local shop owners, uh, tourists, uh, users of the public space, and then we also um, used international reference materials. So we used other shopping streets in the world and other places that had specific qualities that we wanted to see. And of course we um, had some imagineering as it is called. You collect some data and you try to imagine what the space could be and what the space uh, shouldn't be. So we do that by analyzing the space. We talk to a lot of experts, local experts, international experts and we invite them to give a guest lecture. It's a, we are like like absorbing all the knowledge from the others like there's some artists related there are also some like municipality related and also some like uh, even the archaeologists related so we are listening to all the opinions and gathering opinions and then we're looking for some like kind of like insights from them. I think um, possible solutions might be um, trying to use maybe some of the empty space which is um, on top of buildings or um, using some of the spaces uh, in, in the streets to maybe uh, make it easier for people to gather, to, to discuss, to, um, to, to, to just hang out and to have conversations amongst themselves. We don't just want to present something, we want to also create an intervention in public space or a good and decent proposal how to do so. I think the summer school has been really successful. If we manage to present something that is um, very creative and convincing and at the same time applicable and feasible in reality.